I'm Enoch Du, and this time on Retro Revive, I'll be installing 4 gigs of RAM on my Windows 98 gaming PC. Now, I know what you're asking yourself. Why would someone want to install 4 gigs of RAM in a Windows 98 PC? And I'll give you three reasons. And the first reason is, while no Windows 98 application will use more than 512 megabytes of RAM, browsing the web today requires a lot more than that. And when I go to a more demanding website, my browser will just lock up and crash. The second reason is, is you might just want Windows 98 to boot up with four gigs of RAM in the system if you're dual booting with another operating system. And number three is because I can. So first of all, I've heard that the Windows 98 unofficial service pack increases the maximum amount of RAM you can install. But upon installing one gig of RAM, I got the insufficient memory error and Windows 98 would not boot up. And so I got started on installing this unofficial patch I found on some sketchy German website. And it's supposed to expand the ability of Windows 98 to use up to four gigs of RAM. You need to copy it over into your Windows system files and it's laid out in that hierarchy. And so I just pulled out that solid state from my computer and plugged it into my main computer and copied it over that way. You could also copy over the system files while in Windows 98. It was just more convenient for me to plug it into my modern computer. I almost forgot this extra file. The link to that was dead, and so I had to go track it down somewhere else online. But I'll just have them all together in a zip file you could download from my website at retrorevive.enicdo.com in the blog. There will be a link to that below. And so I copied that over and installed the four gigs of RAM and poof, it started up. The first thing I noticed though that was in system properties, it said I only have two and a half gigabytes of RAM. And you know, that's still a lot for Windows 98, but it is a little disappointing that I can't use the full four gigs. And the main thing though, is that I wanted to get this to boot with the four gigs of RAM in it for a future update. Browsing the internet is so much more usable. Facebook before would crash when I went to the login screen, and now I can actually get to my newsfeed. It's super slow because Facebook has so many scripts that are really hammering on my CPU that's just a single core three gigahertz CPU, but it's loading up. And actually when I use Facebook's mobile website, it's really snappy. And of course Gmail's HTML mode works great and Twitter works fine as well. This is a shorter video, but I just wanted to show you guys how I was able to get four gigabytes installed on my Windows 98 gaming PC and like I said, there's the blog as always on retrorevive.enicdo.com. Let me know what you think in the comments below, and I'll catch you next time.